Hello and welcome to another video tutorial where I will show you how to use Nanodrop Spectrophotometer. The Nanodrop Spectrophotometer is a device that can measure the concentration and purity of the DNA, RNA and protein by using a small amounts such as 1 to 2 microliter of samples. So today uh, I will show you how to use this Nanodrop Spectrophotometer and as well uh, by taking the DNA sample as an example. So what are the requirements for today? So we first we will need two microliter micropipette as well as micropipette tips. We should have uh, this uh, tissue or Kim wipes to clean the nanodrop as well as we have this plasmid DNA that we are going to uh, check on this nanodrop for its purity and concentration as well as we have sterile milky water in which we have dissolved this uh, DNA. So make sure that you have the same sterile milky water or the sterile uh, TE buffer in which you have dissolved your DNA, RNA or proteins. So this is a nanorob spectrophotometer from Thermo Scientific and which is connected to the CPU and uh, we have to access through this the software. I will show you the software in a minute. So this is the sampling arm. We have to pull it slowly. And here you can see uh, this one is the upper pedestal and, and this one is the lower pedestals. So we have to load the sample on this pedestal and we have to snap this uh, uh, sampling arm very gently and then we can take the readings. Then we have to access nanorop through the software. First we will open the software and click on nucleic acid since we are measuring DNA. Now in order to initialize the spectrophotometer we need to clean the pedestal and load water sample. We need to load one microliter of uh, nucleus free water or sterile milk or Q water. Make sure that you are not making or forming any kind of bubble on the lower pedestal. Then uh, after adding the sample to the lower pedestal and we have to click on OK. Now this will initialize the spectrophotometer. After initializing the spectrophotometer we will have different sample types for nucleic acid quantification that is DNA, RNA and single stranded DNA. Today we are uh, I am showing uh, how to measure double stranded DNA so I am keeping it on the DNA. Uh, after that we have to correct the baseline so we will measure the blank in which we have dissolved our uh, nucleic acid that is DNA. Then we have to press on the blank. Now it's measuring the blank. Make sure that the same blank you have used or the same sterile milky water that you have used which in which you have dissolved your DNA, RNA or proteins. Now baseline has been correct. Now we will load our DNA sample. Here I am going to load one microliter of, of plasma DNA to check for its purity and concentration. So here you can see uh, we have measured the uh, concentration and purity of the DNA sample. Here you can see uh, the 260 by 280 ratio is 
86 that suggests the purity of the DNA molecule as well as it, uh, it is giving 260 by 230 ratio which mainly talks about the organic solvents in the DNA and uh, then we have the concentration of our DNA sample which is in nanogram per microliter which is 551.5 nanogram. So this is how you measure the concentration and purity of your DNA, RNA and protein sample. If you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.